Hey guys, it's Noel G. DeGavel here, and today I'm talking about a leaked photo of batteries that came from 9to5Mac. Let's go ahead and dive into the specs that it did say. So first off, we did expect a bigger capacity considering this every time Apple releases a new product, most likely in the start, the OS or something starts to drain the power and there's some battery not really battery issues, but um, some battery consumption things need to be worked out. So I did kind of predict that the next iPhone would have a 2,000 milliamp batteries, but according to this um, photo, it says that the um, new voltage on this alleged battery is 3.8 volts, coming from 3.7 volts on the iPhone 4S, and the watts per hour is. Um, 5.45 compared to a 5.25 on the iPhone 4 and 5.3 on the iPhone 4s so in total this is an increase from 1430 milliamps to 1440 milliamps yay a huge jump <laughs> so what they say is this should bring up to about a 10% um, increase in the battery life as the 0.1 jump in the voltage. It's a technology coming out of Motorola and how they have their Droid, Droid Max and the battery technologies. So they said this should give it about a 10% increase. So they're saying that the battery life should still be about the same as the previous generation iPhone 4S. However, due to the LTE rumors, and we're almost... we. we we're first sure going to see LTE no matter what. Um, this would just be enough to accommodate the faster speeds as that will consume more power. But overall, it should get you about the same as before, about s seven hours of battery, which I feel isn't exactly enough because I use my iPhone a ton. But I was kind of hoping for a little bit larger battery, at least going around to the 1800 milliamp range, especially if this would be a new processor or quad core device, and especially because a new OS, iOS 6, in the beginning they will also have some problems with some of the battery consumption issues, kind of like Mountain Lion, how right now they're saying it does consume more power than the previous operating system. So. Thanks for watching guys, please remember to subscribe, I am doing some daily videos on iPhone, as you can see it's really early out, um, just quickly got up and get some news out to you guys right away, so thanks for watching, I'll see you in my next video. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to hit the like button below, if you would like to be notified of future content, please subscribe.